Welcome back. In this week's sponsored Utah success story, Doug Jessup talks to a Utah entrepreneur, as he often does. This one's about a successful company that started with a son and his dad in the garage and led to robots and belts. My dad gave me access to the garage. I had plenty of tools. I like to build things, take things apart, see how things worked. Inventor B.J. Minson went from tinkering when he was a kid to now being the founder and co-owner of a manufacturing company called Grip6. Again, they make a outside. unique belt with no holes and no That's visible good. tail. Grip6 wanted to manufacture their products themselves instead of outsourcing overseas. I personally think it's just a deep, responsible thing to say. Okay, we're going to do this ourselves because it's difficult and it's hard and the chance of failure is high. But if you do something yourself, you're going to be more invested and you're going to do a better job at it. It's been said necessity is the mother of invention. Their products are so unique, they ended up designing and building some of their own machines. Co-owner David Burton gave me the tour. With the buckles, we bring in American sourced aluminum. The laser cuts the buckles out of that sheet. They get routed, they get chamfered on the edges and inside the holes, they get stamped and they get bent. One of the last steps is a machine called a tumbler that gives the buckles a nice, smooth finish. Some of the buckles are made using robots. Right now we have two robots. Within a year we'll probably have, you know, another four to five. I wasn't surprised to see machines they made putting finishing touches on their belt straps. Grip6 also has laser engraved machines to put logos and images on their belts and wallets. So what's next? We're making high quality wool socks. The wool is largely sourced from the Rocky Mountains. What's it like for Minson to see his patented belt invention take off? That's pretty incredible. This was in my garage a couple of years ago and now people are finding us online and it's a good enough product that it kind of sells itself. And thank goodness because I'm a terrible salesman. With another Utah success story and a new belt manufactured right here in Utah by Grip6, I'm Doug Jessup, ABC4 News. I like those buckles. Maybe not the one Doug has. He can keep that one. But the trees, that one was cool. All right, to see more Utah success stories and nominated business for Doug to profile, all of it is on our website, abc4.com success.